Hello and good morning, y'all, and welcome to Urbex, which does not have a title screen or anything, just kind of puts you right in the game. Uh, this one's been up for a few years on Itch, and it kind of stood out to me, so I really wanted to kind of give it a go here. I think it's going to be like a 5 to 10 minute long experience. I believe, like, the store page said this is like a prototype sort of deal, uh, but it looks like it might be pretty good. Uh, so let's kind of give it a go, see what's up, don't really know what to expect, and I'll have a link to it in the description if you want to play it yourself. But I believe the general gist is we're stuck in this building and we got to kind of find a way out and find secrets and get just not die or something. Uh, huh. Okay. Well, let's see what we got here. Okay, those are doors. Gotcha. But yeah, uh, this one kind of stood out to me for a particular reason. And that's because I have a friend over on Twitch that was making a game a few years back called Urbex. And when I scrolled by and I saw this, I was like, is this the same game? Uh, it is not. Rude. Uh, it is not. It is a different game. That looks like a key. There we go. Here? No. Uh, so I went, cool. Let's play this. It's not his Urbex, but it's still an Urbex. I can finally play it. I'm assuming we're going to use the key over in the door here, let's say. Yep. Sweet. So far, this is pretty nice, though. Looks kind of nice. Really got the whole dilapidated building sort of deal. Alright. So this stands out to me. What is this? Is it like a... I think I have an idea. Hold on. Hold on. There's a lot of wires in there, but I wonder if that's like supposed to be like a fuse box, because I remember seeing like a fuse down here. I wonder. Hold. Yeah, you can pick that up. Cool. Doesn't really look like a fuse box, but like I know my indie horror games at this point. <laughs> probably gonna put that in here. That's probably gonna open up the gate down there, right? Let's see. Yeah. Bingo bango dodge Durango. Yeah, so far so good here. More running around, okay. So now what are we doing? So we really should just kind of like stock like all the shelves and stuff for like just objects you can pick up. Got it. Really just give things the uh, the old once over, if you will. Hmm. So far, nothing really standing out. Stop breaking shit, that's so rude. Man, there's another... There's another fuse we gotta find? Oh, I don't know where to begin to look. Okay. It's a big area. So let's cover all of it, shall we? There's nothing here. Just rename this game, like, Fishing for Fuses. Okay, nothing in the locker. Gotcha. Nice wooden interior lockers, too. Those are fancy, dude. Oh, those are just tin cans? Empty tin cans. Okay. Back here. I heard like all the movement back here. So I was like wondering if like something opened up. But that does not seem to be what happened. So I guess it was just like a sound effect. Oh wait, I wonder if I can take the um the fuse back from over here. Hi. Can I take this back? That was actually kind of creepy. Okay, you cannot take that back. God damn it, wait. <gasps> there it is. It bur burst out of this locker. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Where did all these things come from? That's kind of loud. Hold. Don't kill me. I gotta tab out. That's like really loud in my ears. I don't know if it's loud in the video. That's really loud in my ears. I'm dropping that down. Holy crap. 
That's a little bit more acceptable. Ain't that right, mannequin? Well, at least we know they're not alive, ready to kill us. And they're definitely naked. You know, I've had I've had my fill. <clears throat> Gonna give you a hand. Uh, you you are definitely a little bit spoopy looking. I got like weeping angel vibes. Like, uh oh, I have no control over this. Hello. You don't look at it, it gets you. I don't know. Let's get out. Let's not get out. Huh. I mean, mannequins are kind of creepy to some people. And that was pretty cool. All right, I don't mind that. I don't mind that at all. That was, that was actually really cool. Just fuse collection, the video game, and like the, there was like some decent like kind of scare and like atmosphere there. It wasn't much to it, uh, but that that was fun. Uh, that was Urbex. I'll have a link again in the description to the video if you want to check it out yourself. Uh, but I guess we're gonna call the video there. So thank you all very much for watching. You all have a lovely day, and as always, toodles, y'all.